Hello, hikers. Andy here, one of the co-founders of Hike. So really, really exciting announcement today. And we've got three, three announcements, actually, that we're launching today for July. Um, and I want to take you through them. Um, it's very, very exciting. We've been waiting on these for, for a long time, especially this first one. Now, the first one I'm going to take you through in this video uh, and then briefly touch on the next announcements. But go back and read the email. It goes into it in more detail. Yeah, so this first announcement, really, really exciting. We've been working on it for what feels like forever, right? Um, let me tell you where it started. So we do a lot of delivery for our customers. We've been doing SEO for a long time. We've got thousands of customers that always struggle with creating that core SEO content, right? So your page title and your meta description and what appears on Google, so important, right? Improves click-through rates. Getting your keywords in there is so important for ranking for those keywords. Uh, your H head, H1 heading as well, super important on-page element. You know, they're, they're almost the key fundamentals. You get those right, that's where everything else kind of falls underneath that. So. But one thing we get from customers and even from our own team is it's really difficult to create that content. Create an optimized page title. Meta descriptions, what a pain they can be, right? You've got to create 150 to 170 characters, right? 155 to 170 characters. It's got to be unique. It's got to um, have a call to action. It's got to include your keywords. It's tough, but it's worthwhile because it improves your SEO and the amount of clicks you get. The H1 heading, you know, how do you format it so that you can get your keywords in there? That again, that's really, really tricky. And it can take so much time. Our team spend around almost 50% of their time just creating that kind of content. Wouldn't it be great if, it could, if the platform could just automatically create it for you? Well, you're in luck. <laughs> um, we, we do. So this is our big announcement. So we're using artificial intelligence to generate this content. Okay, what it's going to do is going to take the keywords that you've assigned. So this is really, really important. Um, you have to make sure for any 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 page you want to use this feature for that you've added keywords and you've assigned it on the sitemap. What happens then is we've trained an AI content tool to the specification that we want. We've trained it so that it can take those keywords that you give it and spit out an optimized page title, meta description, H1, that you can literally copy and paste straight onto your website. You know it's perfectly optimized. It's quick. It's easy. It's, easy, it's going to save you so much time. Um, so you can see I'm getting quite excited about it. So let me go through and show you how it works. So if we go down, your actions page is where you'll see this. Now, if we scroll down, I won't do it on the home page, let's choose an internal page. You'll see this little yellow button. Again, it will only show for any pages you've assigned keywords to, because that's what Hike needs to know. That's what the, the AI content tool needs to know um, in order to generate it. And we're calling it the content wizard, right? Something a little bit catchy, but the content wizard is going to create this content for you. So you click on the little button, content wizard. What it's going to do then is it's going to generate for you three options for your title tag, your meta description, and your H1 heading. So if you don't like the first option, because remember, this is an AI that's generating this. This AI has been trained on millions of words, millions of topics, right? So it can do this for any topic. And, you know, if you think you're in a specific niche, don't worry. We're going to be able to create you a page title, meta description, H1, because we've trained it for you. Great. So first off, it's going to give you a, a title tag. Now this, you'll see, is based on the information it's got. So at the top, the company name. If you've added your GMB into Hike, you can using the local feature, we'll grab the company name from there. If you haven't, really, really important, you click this update here and add your company name. Because that's what we use to append to your uh, title tags. Use it in your meta description, because you want reference of your business, because that's what Google loves, right? Um, the keywords that are on that page, so you can see the keywords that the content wizard is using to generate this data, right? So let's have a quick look. Title tag, so my keyword, SEO agency software, SEO agency platform. So you can see here, option one, really simple. It's got my first keyword and my second keyword, company name at the end. So this is just a surefire way of doing a page title. You know, keyword one, keyword two, works really, really nicely. Then it's generated a completely unique, this is all completely unique, meta description. How amazing is that, right? Hike's a powerful SEO agency software. Yes, it is. An SEO agency platform. So it's got the two keywords in there designed for small and medium-sized businesses. We didn't write this. The AI did this, right? Um, SEO agency software, and that's the H1, and SEO agency platform. Let me rerun the content wizard, show you what happens. So it's reviewing the keywords. It's grabbing it. It's working out. It's going, what content should I create? And look, it's created it completely different. Again, SEO agency software and platform. So it hasn't repeated SEO agency this time, but it's still got your two keywords being mentioned in there. Hikes a powerful SEO design for inside business. So it's kept the same meta description there in option one, but we can go through option two and option three. Let me show you option two. So you might go, actually, I don't really like option one. Let me look at option two. Oh, I like that title tag. Oh, that meta description's better. Or oh, that H1's better. And then option three. Okay, great. And I've got, so you've got three options, right? And if you like them, what you can do, you can copy it. 
copies it automatically, you can paste it straight into your website. So if you're on WordPress, paste it straight into Yoast or Rank Math or whatever you're using. Squarespace, Shopify, Wix, Webflow, copy and paste it straight in. The meta description, the H1 heading. But let's say you want to just change this. So I might go SEO software and agency platform supplier. I might change it to provider, right? Okay, so I can change it there. Um, and then I can copy it and use it. So it's going to save so much time, so much time for you guys. And then you know that it's all been optimized correctly. Now, the differences between option one, option two, and option three are the level of creativity. So the AI that we've trained, we've trained it on different levels of creativeness, right? You can imagine uh, a content writer who's really creative goes outside the box. They bring in um, different topics, different niches. They kind of go a bit crazy with their content, but sometimes you want that. Whereas option one's like the, the more conservative writer. You know, they, they like the rules. They want to make sure the keyword's being included. Uh, they want to make sure they're, they're fitting all the best practices. So if you use option one, you know you're going to be ticking all the boxes when it comes to an SEO point of view. Option two is somewhere in the middle, and option three is a little bit more creative. Now, as you run it and keep rerunning it, you'll see that. You'll see that you'll get different ones. And you might like some things from option three. You might like the meta description from option three. You might like the page title from option one and the H1 from uh, option two. It's completely up to you. And obviously, you can run the content wizard, um, and it will just reuse the data. So everyone gets... 15 credits per month. So that means you can generate three options for the title tag, meta description, H1 for 15 different pages every single month. So if you've got a fairly small site, you're absolutely fine. If you've got a bigger site, it'll refresh the next month. Now you can upgrade. You can upgrade and get more credits. So let me see if I can show you how this works. Okay, cool. So you can choose to upgrade. You click upgrade. And what it's going to do then, it's going to show you two upgrade options. Now, I'm based in the UK, so you can see that um, it's based in pounds. But if you're, if you're in US dollars, you'll get the option for that as well. So there's two upgrades you can get. You can get an additional 15 credits per month. So that will put you up to a total of 30 credits per month. And that will cost £8.40 or $10 per month. Or you can get unlimited credits. And that means you can generate as much content um, as you want for as many pages per month um, for £16.80 or $20. And you can keep running it and keep running it and keep running it. It's absolutely fine, right? So yeah, this is something that we're just so excited to, to launch because we know firsthand, having done SEO for ourselves for years, just how time consuming and how difficult it can be to create that content, but how important it is. And we've never been able to, the technology's never been there to be able to train an AI to the, to the level of specifications that we want to make sure that you guys are able to create that meta, that, that metadata as well as possible. So look, if you've already got page titles and meta descriptions, you might not want to use it, but you might still want to use it because you know that they're going to be, they're based on SEO best practices and you might want to replace what you've already got. So yeah, that's absolutely it. Let me just double check I've ran through everything because I don't want to miss anything here. Let's go back to the agency one. I think one other thing just to say is you'll see this little warning icon next to them. So for example, in the title tag here, this will be when that title tag that's been generated won't hit some of our checks. So, you know, obviously as users a hike, there are certain checks that we have, you know, keywords being mentioned uh, within the right character limit. So we run all of these suggestions through that. So, you know, okay, well, if I'm going to use this suggestion, that's great, but it will flag something on hikes. So let me make a quick amendment. Okay, cool. So the title tag is too short. So this is the one it doesn't pass. The title tag is too short. It should be between 55 and 80 characters long. So what I might do here is I might just change this to um, SEO agency software and SEO platform. Now, if I click save changes, what it's going to do is it's still saying it's too short. So now let me do agency platform. Check again. Is it still too short? Still too short. Okay. But you can play around and play around and basically once you hit it, it will disappear, right? But that means you can make sure it's perfect before you upload it to your website. Then you know it's going to pass every single height check. So yes, that's the big announcement, the SEO content wizard. Let us know what you guys think. It's brand new technology. We've been training it for a while. It's really exciting, but we'd love to hear your feedback. Um, another, another thing, we're going to start using this content wizard throughout the platform, right? So if you think it's going to be limited just to page titles, meta description, your top, the kind of fundamental SEO content, it's not. We're going to use it for all the other parts of the platform. So um, yeah, look out for more and more updates around this. So that's update number one, content wizard. Update number two, our summer sale is launched. If you're still watching now, nine and a half minutes in, well done. Um, our summer sale is launched. What this means is for, for people who want to add in extra websites, so maybe you're a business with multiple websites or you're an agency that looks after multiple clients, we're reducing the price um, of you adding websites in. So what previously was £35 or $45 is now 
25 pounds or 35 dollars a month so it's cheaper which means that you can use this tool across more websites for, for less price basically and then the final announcement is we've, we've released a brand new package called done with you so a lot of our clients they, they use hike and they want to do it on a, on a kind of diy right do it yourself but what they find is actually they don't have all the time, every single month to do everything. Now we can complete actions, as you can see here, you can do ad hoc actions. We also go to the other side and we have more of an agency service where we can completely do it for you. We call it our done for you services. And we've got packages up to eight hours per month. But what if you're in the middle, right? What if you wanna use the do it yourself, but you don't have the time to do everything, but you still wanna keep control of your SEO, or you want help training, or you want us to do certain things, we have a done with you package. So we'll be an extension of your team, right? So this will be perfect if you're struggling for time, or if you've got a team that you wanna train up, this is perfect for you. We'll support you uh, for an additional two hours per month, and you can you can essentially use that two hours wherever you want, right? I mean, we've got a roadmap that we, that we think we should help you with, so we can almost train you and your team month by month on the different areas. Um, or you can get us to write content, you can get us to build citations, you can get us to do some on-site changes, whatever you, wherever you feel the need to use us. So, yeah. There we go. There's the three announcements. I hope you found this, this useful. It's really exciting for us. We've got some really cool stuff coming up in the next few months. Uh, we're growing as a team, which means that we can provide a better service and a better platform. So have a great week, everyone, and we'll catch up very soon. All right. Bye-bye.